we done a scouting mission yesterday, didn't we? And we saw a yeah, barn we owl. Yeah, we watched him. Which is good because I've not seen it in this location for a while. Um, a couple of months, yeah. So we're just walking to the location. Is it Robin? I bought my roll mat. Donkey's so, um, carrying it. Donkey's carrying it. <laughs> donkey? I'd never call you a... Oh, I'd never call you a donkey. And I bought the drone as well to do... Um, hopefully to get some just general footage. So we'll uh, speak to you soon. We've got a good chance today because it, it was bitter night, wasn't it? Yes, that was very cold. Completely frosty this morning, so... A cold night last night and very cold this morning, so... Hopefully, Mr. Barney is going to be out now. You just completely talk over me and nick my line. <laughs> so we're walking down to the river. Um, where we're going to stick the drone up, have a little fly. Um, stick, bring the drone down. And then, hopefully... The bar now will show. He is there. I'm set up on the tree. Need to change my battery. Which is right around this bend tucked up there. I've come down to a spot where we know the barn owl flies to, hoping for a perched shot. Gemma is further along about a good quarter of a mile further along the path near where his tree is. I'm going to be shooting with the Nikon 300mm 2.8 with a 1.4 times converter on so that will be 420 and f4 on the d850 um, so I can crop fairly heavily into that if I need to because I'm hopefully going to when he flies I'm just going to wait for him to come to me try not to be too trigger happy that is a problem of mine <laughs> I tend to get a bit um, heavy on the shutter button when I see him, but I'm gonna try and wait for him to come closer to me. Uh, see if we can get a perch shot, maybe, or some in flight hunting. He was hunting definitely in this spot yesterday. And there is a, a small stream, lake, that runs through the land in front here which is great for voles, water voles, mice, which obviously what they feed on. Because it was so cold this morning, as we said, we're hoping he's gonna come out this evening and put on a bit of a show. He is out. He's sitting there. Don't think you can see. Well, you can't see, but I can see. He's sitting in his little tree hole. He's out. Look out. Hello. Hi, he's out. Okay. Is he? Yeah, I'm literally filming him. He is out. What, at the hole? Okay, I'll get down in position then. It's got a little bit colder now, back my hat on. He is sitting, literally just sitting in the tree. So I've got to, I've got to get ready because I want to get some shots. Now the worrying thing is, is do I film him coming out of the tree so I can show everyone? Or do I switch to photos? and get some photographs of him coming out. I don't know, I don't know what to do. I, I wanna do both, I wanna do both, I'll try and do both.
he's caught he's been on the field and caught his dinner Amazing to watch him. There's two. There's two. There's two. Got to tell you. Hello. There's two. There's two. The two. They're sitting in the tr tree. I'm currently filming them now. Awesome. I've been um, watching it in the tree after it caught a vole and took it back to the tree and sat there to eat it. And then another one's come along. There's two. I only thought there was one. I've been only watching one. There's two. And now they're both flying about. I don't know if Richard's fed any luck because I, t I told him to come over this way because I had them both in the tree. But then they both flew off towards him, so. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Oh, one's coming this way. This one's caught something as well. They like to, I don't know if that's because of how cold it is, they like to take their catch home and eat, eat their dinner indoors. It's been amazing. Two barn owls, not just one barn owl, two barn owls. Um, I was concentrating so much on trying to video them to show you guys that one flew over my head. <laughs> I have managed to get a couple of photos, um, but the lights, I don't know, the lights fading now, you can see, it's um, about quarter past four now, and um, I'm cold, I don't know how, how Richard got on, so I'm going to go find him and see if he <clears throat> if he fared as good as me. Okay. Look who I've just found. And look at the smile on my face. Because we saw two. <laughs> Didn't we? Male and female, I'm presuming. No must, idea. Must be, surely. They're together. You wouldn't have two males together, would you? Um, I don't know. They only meet up in, in like, March. I reckon that's a male and female, which Probably. means they might be breeding here. They do breed here. Yeah, but this year, because we've seen yeah. two. I'm happy. Didn't get, I got a couple of shots, but I was trying to be really disciplined today and not do my And I did, but then I got to a point where I was watching them for about two minutes, close to me, and I hadn't taken a picture because I wanted them to come closer. Then they buggered off. 
Then they came back again. Oh. And I got a couple of pictures, but I was, that was just so, so lovely seeing them. I don't care really if I've, I ain't got a brilliant picture. That was so good seeing them. But we've got loads to show you, haven't we, Gemma? How do you know? You don't know yet. I haven't you told, told you. me that we've got video. So. There's video well and there will be stills. I'm This is us, we're, I'm tired, I haven't got, where is the, we haven't got a gimbal. No, this we're, is this our is wonky handheld. goodbye. Yeah, this is our wonky goodbye from the Suffolk coast. Happy as Larry. Cause we, <laughs> happy as Larry. Because we didn't just oh. see one bar now, we saw two. Which I was not expecting. And you weren't expecting to see two. No. No. No, didn't see so two yesterday. We will be we hitting this spot big time, I think, over the next few weeks. Got to. Well, we'll see. Got to, considering we'll it's see. 10 minutes up the road. We'll see. Right. So, this is Rich, and that's Jem <laughs> saying goodbye from I can't, cold I can't Suffolk. angle myself in very well. So my hand's hurting now. Mm -hmm. Just right. say goodbye, it's too cold. Goodbye, it's too cold. What were you saying we could possibly see down here? Wimbrels? You didn't, you didn't pronounce it for me. W... W-H-I-M... Oh, bull crap. I don't know. <laughs>